Hello everyone, I'm Robin Xie from WeChat Tencent. I'm very glad to introduce this work for you. The title of this paper is Personalized Approximate Pareto Efficient Recommendation, which focuses on the multi-objective recommendation task. This research is conducted by the WeChat Top Stories team of Tencent. Real-world recommendation systems usually have multiple objectives to meet users' diverse needs, which is noted as multi-objective recommendation. These objectives may include CTR, dwell time, user activeness, user stickness, and diversity. These objectives are often contradictory. It is challenging to simultaneously optimize all objectives to improve the overall user experience. To address the, uh, the multi-objective recommendation, Pareto efficiency is introduced, which is regarded as an optimal state where no objective could be further improved without hurting others. Here, we give some brief introductions to some essential notions about Pareto efficiency. The first is the domination. We can say that situation A dominates B only if all objects of A perform better than the corresponding objectives of B. In the right figure, we can find that both CTR and the dwell time of A are better than those of C. Hence, we can say that A dominates C and similarly B dominates C. If there is no situation in the overall space that dominates A, then A is regarded as Pareto efficient. In this work, we want our model to reach a Pareto efficiency point. There are several works that have brought Pareto efficiency in multi-objective recommendation. However, these works are often based on the scalarization method with a shared objective weight set for all users and items, ignoring the user's objective level preferences. Here in the scalar scalarization, we want personalized objective weights omega i for different users and items. Therefore, we attempt to bring in personalizations at the objective level. In this work, we propose a novel framework named Personalized Approximate Pareto Efficient Recommendation, shorted as Paper Rack for multi-objective recommendation. In the left figure, we can see that user A usually watches videos and thus cares more about the dual time metric. On the contrary, user B usually reads news and thus cares more about the CTR metric. Therefore, in our paper rack, we want to optimize for user A and user B simultaneously, but towards different directions according to their objective level preferences. Here, we introduce the overall framework of our paper rack. Paper rack is an approximate method that closely mimics Pareto efficiency, where users have personalized objective weights in scalarization. These objective weights could be viewed as a certain reflection of users' objective level preferences. Specifically, we implement paper rack with two objectives, including CTR and Duetai, on the real-world list-wise recommendation model in which are top stories. We build two single objective models to optimize for these two objectives separately. We also propose the Pareto-oriented reinforcement learning model to learn the personalized objective weights to balance different objectives which is the central part of paper rack. The Pareto-oriented IL model sets a reward that aims to approximately optimize towards the Pareto stationary point. Precisely, we build a personalized scalarization-based loss with personalized objective weights as the overall loss function. The right figure gives the pseudo code of the paper rack algorithm. In each batch, we first calculate the losses of each single objective model. Second, we update all 
Pareto-oriented IO parameters while the IO losses, which will be introduced in the following pages. Third, we generate new objective weights while the updated Pareto-oriented IO model and calculate the weighted personalized scalarization in the left uh, with the new objective weights. And finally, we update two single objective models according to the weighted losses. So how does the Pareto-oriented IO model work? We first see some definitions and proofs in MGDA. MGDA proposes a Pareto stationary notion as follows. Well, the sum of the sum of objective weights equals one, and the weighted sum of all objective gradients equals zero. MGDA proves that if a situation is Pareto efficient, then it is Pareto stationary. Hence, the Pareto stationarity situation can be transferred into the minimization problem as follows. MGDA also verifies that either the solution of this minimization optimization is zero, which indicates that the situation satisfies the KKT conditions and reaches the Pareto stationarity, or the situation gives a descent direction that can simultaneously optimize all objectives. Therefore, therefore, if we can train the Pareto-oriented IO model to make most weighted sums of all objectives gradients equal zero or reach their minimization points, the optimization can be approximately Pareto-efficient. Therefore, the Pareto-oriented IO is directly trained for the minimization problem. We build an IO framework to consider the contextual information in recommendation sessions and lists. The state describes the current situation when IO has recommended objective weights for various items in the list. The action is giving a set of objective weights at the T position in the list. The reward is the negative L2 nor of the weighted sum of all objectives gradients. A higher reward indicates that the overall item list is more close to the Pareto optimization. Here gives the neural network architecture of the Pareto oriented IL. We take the user profiles, impression behaviors, click behaviors, recommendation contexts, and historical objective weights as inputs, and output a set of personalized objective weights for the current user and item pair. We use DTPG to train this IO model. As for the single CTR and DT-oriented models, we use the similar neural networks with different parameters. The overall loss of our paper rack is the weighted loss combination of the Pareto-oriented IO model and the single objective models. In experiments, we conduct extensive offline and online experiments aiming to answer the following three research questions. First, how does our proposed paper rack model perform against the state-of-art baselines. Question 2. How does PaperRack perform in online systems with various multi spec online evaluation metrics? Question 3. What do the personalized objective weights learn and reflect? Are they reasonable? We evaluate PaperRack on a real-world multi-objective recommendation dataset of which are top stories to verify the importance of the objective level personalization and the effectiveness of our paper rack in modeling such personalization. Here gives the offline evaluation of CTR and due time prediction. We find that our paper rack has significant improvements over baselines on all metrics. 
These two scatter plots directly illustrate the CTR and DT performances of our models and baselines. We can find that different paper rack versions dominate most of competitive baselines by a large margin, especially for the dual time related metrics that are hard to improve in real world system. It verifies the effectiveness of our model in optimizing multiple obje objectives. In paper rack, both single objective models can be trained more efficiently and wisely to handle users' objective level personalization. To verify our model in real-world scenarios, we conduct an online A-B test in which are top stories. We can find that all paper rack models has consistent improvements on all online metrics, including CTR, dual time, and diversity. The personalized objective weights are influenced by both users and items. Therefore, we want to know which characters of users and items will affect objective level personalization and whether they are reasonable. Precisely, we collect polarized instances and group them into top CTR weight and top DT weight groups. We find that videos have higher dual time weights. Moreover, higher CTR weights are really accompanied by higher CTR and lower dual time per click, which makes sense in real world systems. At last, we highlight our contributions of this work. We first propose a novel paper rack framework and a Pareto oriented IO model for multi objective recommendation. To the best of our knowledge, we are the first attempt to bring objective level personalization into Pareto oriented recommendation. Both online and offline results on a real world recommendation system confirm the effectiveness of our model. We have deployed the paper rack on which are top stories affecting millions of users. That's all my presentation. Thank you for listening.